Hey guys, so today I'm going to be talking about the Razer Huntsman Mini's lighting effects. And usually, this is in a lot of other reviews, but I wanted to make this video shorter just so you don't have to go through all of them. Speaking of, let's get to it. So, there's about six lighting effects and one command to turn off the lighting effect. Um, the way you change the colors and lighting effects is by pressing function, control, and the numbers 1 through 7. So, function control 1 basically turns off the lighting effect in total. This is for someone that probably has a problem with RGB, maybe? I'm not sure. Um, but yeah. Anyways, so, function control 2 is a static color. And yes, you can change the color by pressing function control 2 again. And yes, this changes the color, and you can keep pressing it until you are satisfied with the color you have. Function control 3 is basically like a breathing effect, and yes, you can change the color of this too um, by pressing function control 3 again. Function control uh, 4 is a spectrum cycling, and I do remember I did forget the word in my review about the GK61 lighting effects, and I promised myself that I would never forget the name of this. And yeah, to this day, I still haven't forgotten, trust me guys. I did my research, I promise you. Function control 5 is Razer's um, standard wave on their keyboards. It's the one we know and love um, for sure. This is a really nice one. This is the standard one too. If you press function control 6, that is a reactive one. Therefore, every key you press, each key lights up, which I find really cool because that is a really nice one. Although the GK61 has um, more lighting effects, although I do like this one because yeah, it, it is one I'm familiar with because I had a Razer keyboard in the past. Function Control 7 is the last one. It is Starlight. Um, this one you can change the key, um, the colors as well. So as the reactive one, I forgot to mention that. If you guys have any questions in the comments, please let me know. I wanted to make this a shorter video just so you didn't have to go through all of the reviews. But hey, you know, we'll never know. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, leave it in the comment section below. I will try to answer them as much as possible. And yeah, thank you for watching. Peace out, guys.